Hello friends, welcome back to my kitchen. Today I'm going to show you a recipe on how to make sunny side bullseye egg curry. This is a very delicious recipe and this makes a perfect combination with hot steaming rice, bread, chapati, naan, parota or hot steaming idlis. Today I'm going to eat this with our millet idlis and I'm going to leave a, a recipe on the description below to check it out and to give it a try. Come along and I'm going to show you how to make this recipe. So for this recipe, we will require three red tomatoes, one green bell pepper, and one medium to large red onion. I'm going to chop everything fine and I'll show you the next steps. So to our cast iron kadai, I'm going to add about three to four tablespoons of olive oil. So while my oil is getting heated, here I have panch poran. This is a Bengali tempering uh, spices. It comes about five spices. There is um, fenugreek seeds, cumin seeds, fennel seeds, white split gram, that is odad dal, the kalonji, then uh, the onion seeds, and the mustard. I'm going to include all of these into my description box below. So we'll go ahead and add this. curry leaves, chopped onions, the onions are nice translucent, to this I am going to add about 1 teaspoon of homemade ginger garlic paste, I will leave a description below to on how to make this homemade ginger garlic paste. I will add the chopped bell peppers. Now we we'll let this bell pepper cook until it's completely chopped. It might take another five six minutes. Bell peppers are perfectly cooked. To so this, we'll go ahead and add the chopped tomatoes. We'll cook the tomatoes until it's perfectly nice and soft. So onions, tomatoes and the bell peppers are cooked just right. To this I'm going to add all the spices now. One teaspoon coriander powder. One teaspoon cumin powder. One teaspoon fennel seed powder. 1 teaspoon red chilli powder, 1 teaspoon Kashmiri red chilli powder, quarter teaspoon turmeric powder, quarter teaspoon garam masala powder. So give everything a quick stir. Let the spices cook in the sauce for about two minutes. To this, I'm going to add about a quarter cup of water. Salt, about one teaspoon or according to your taste. Add half the coriander first. Now to this I'm going to add about five eggs. Now 
we'll go ahead and cover the lid and let this cook in a low flame for about four to five minutes so we have a couple of options here either you can have the egg yolk completely cooked thoroughly cooked or semi cooked or sunny side up so we like it almost like a semi bullseye kind of a consistency so i let this cook for another three to four minutes and then i'll turn off the heat eggs have cooked perfectly right and to this i'm going to go ahead and finish off with my cilantro some more garnishing So our sunny side egg is ready to be served with our millets idlis. So our millet idlis are also ready. So let's go ahead and check it out. So they're perfectly cooked. So our millets idli is perfectly cooked. It is extremely soft, 